welcome to Path of Titans, where today my settings are wrong. Hold on, I need to change my key bodies. Anyways, today we are looking at the Teutonia mod to check out a new island they've put in. Um, I'm having trouble getting other mods to work. Sorry, I do want to look at them. There we go, that's better. But uh, I do want to look at other mods. I just, I can't get them to work right now. But Teutonia works, so we're going to look at the new island they've put in. Swimmy, swimmy, swimmy. And I chose Iguanodon because I like Iguanodon. It has just such a good model, such a good backer skin. I like its animations. I think it's just a jiggy. You did great on the Iguanodon. Love it. I would play it more often, but I like Ceratopsids better. But Iguanodon's just fun. He just looks great. He moves great. So smooth, and he definitely has my favorite backer skin. I just I have such a thing for tail stripes. I don't know why. I like tail stripes. Anyways, let us head. I think I think I'm going the right direction. I was looking at the map, and this area down here is new. And luckily, I actually spawned right here. Like you can see, the rest of the map is fog of war. And like we've been all the way up to the volcano island. But we haven't been down here to the south, so I think this is the new island. And like I said, luckily it spawned me down here anyways, so hurrah. Yeah, the Guanadon just looks great. His noises could use a bit of tweaking, though. They do seem a bit quiet for such a big creature. Anyways... I think they also put in like new grass and dirt textures. I'll ha I, I skimmed over their patch notes for the past couple updates. Oh yeah, I think I see cactus over there, which is definitely new. Hopefully we have enough stamina to get across. Hopefully at least. Swim, swim. I like the water too. Though I think I like Cerulean's water better. This water's still nice. I can't eat the cactus. I was kind of hoping I could, but I can't eat the cactus. Wouldn't that be fun though? Trying to remember what the name of that tree is. We actually have that tree around here. Is that a yucca? Oh, trying to remember. We actually have that where I live, because I live in the desert. So, cactus make me happy. Not these, you know, the cl cliche classic appearance of a cactus with an arm on either side. I don't like that version of cactus because you hardly ever actually see cactus like that. They're, those are sagueros, but they have they, their arms are so varied and interesting to see that boring rendition of them is just sad for me. I'm a bit of a cactus snob since I live around to them, and oh, look, it's the giant bird skull again. I don't want to meet a bird with that was that big. But yeah, that cactus right there to my right and to my left, I don't like that version of cactus, even though it's like the cliche classic cactus look. Because, like, they do look like that, but it's just, it's so boring compared to the real thing. And whack the T-Rex skeleton with our tail. I feel like that's a yucca. Is it, though? Maybe I'm, I'm, I'm trying to remember. There's so many different names for them here. Maybe it's not a, no, I might, uh, I'm trying to remember. I know I've seen them around. I just don't remember what they're called. I think it's a yucca, though. I'm going to call it a yucca. Because that's what I always refer them to as, even if I'm misremembering them. What is that? Is that that xenomorph skull again? I think it is. I think that's the xenomorph skull. Because this is the same map where we went and found the bat cave that had the skulls and the xenomorph skull and Batman. Batman. 
so many skeletons. We need to get some food and water, though. I do see a little bit of water on the map up here. Bushes! Yay! I can't eat. Oh. Oh no, now the option's not even popping up. Well, that's mods for you. Yeah, mods, mods, always. I mean, that's why they're in testing. That's why they're not public yet. Apparently, currently on this mod, you can't eat. You probably can't drink then either. I'll have to be sure to report that to the, the mod channel so that they know that there's an issue with eating and drinking. After all, I'm not just making videos. I'm actually testing too. water. Nope, can't drink either. This water looks great though, doesn't it? I kind of like the green underneath the green rock with all that algae looking. Gives the water an interesting texture. Oh well, I'll be sure to report it and we will move on. Or maybe we'll take a screenshot. I do like taking screenshots. Let's see, let's, this looks like a nice spot. Turn that down a little. Zoom. Well, you want to get a little bit of the water in too, though. Do, 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 do. That's a nice picture of the dandelion right there, ain't it? Isn't it? I don't like the word ain't. I don't know why I said that. Gotta get thumbnail pictures somehow, right? I don't know. It's a weird thing about me. I'm sorry. I like to have thumbnails actually be from the video I took. You know what I mean? Like, if you have a thumbnail of Sarko, for example, and then you don't do a single thing with Sarko in the video, I don't know. I just I feel like that's misleading. Like, if I'm going to be playing Iguanodon on the desert map, then I want my thumbnail to be Iguanodon on the desert map, you know? I don't want it to be a Stegosaurus on the Cerulean mod map when I'm not playing Stegosaurus and I'm not on Cerulean mod map. It's just how I am. I like my thumbnails to be descriptive and representative of what I'm playing and what I'm doing. So... Yeah, anyways, all right. Onwards we go. Looks like we can't eat or drink, so, you know, we have a bit of a time limit. You know, until we starve to death, but that's okay. There's a lot of rocks over here. I know, this desert feels very cold. I think it's because there's like a slight bluish tinge to everything. It's probably just the lighting on the map itself, but, you know deserts you normally expect a warmer color a warmer feel i do like the blowing dust the blowing sand is pretty cool i do like that we need to get a desert picture though because like i said if i'm being a guanodon on a desert map or a desert island then i want a picture my thumbnail needs to be a guanodon in the desert and that oasis picture while accurate doesn't quite represent the video as well as i would like it to so we're going to find a good spot with a desert landscape behind us. And then that'll be the last screenshot, I promise. This seems like a nice spot. Alright. Let's try... Hmm. 
an interesting pose, but he looks way too happy for a desert. We should put our head down like we're tired and exhausted and thirsty and hot because it's a desert. Not good enough. What if we put our head down and roar so our mouth is open? Let's try it that way. And roar. Oh, now he looks, now he looks good. He's tired, he's hot. He wants a drink in this barren desert. Ah, I like to tell a story with my pictures, with my thumbnails. Okay. I don't really, I don't feel like this is a good angle though. It's very boring. Let's change the, uh, let's try to adjust the colors just a tad to make it feel more like a desert. More like the desert I'm used to, I should say, because this is using the, the plants I'm used to, but the colors are wrong. Let's see if we can't fix that. Just not too, nothing too drastic, just, just a little. We need a little bit of a yellow tinge. There we go, that's a little better. Let's raise the set, oop, too much. Up the saturation a tad. I like how the little thin grass in the sky could be like vultures flying or something. I know this isn't completely representative of the game because I've adjusted the colors, but oh well. It's close enough. It's better than what some people do. Not naming any names. But yeah, I've always felt that thumbnails should represent what the video is talking about or represent or, you know, showing or doing. Anyways. Just making some small tweaks. Last screenshot, I promise. One of these will be a thumbnail. All right, I think we're good. Yeah, I don't like that angle. But I just wanted to make sure. Okay. Let us, ugh, it's so cold feeling, so blue tinged. Anyways, I'm probably just crazy. Like I said, I actually live in this kind of biome. So I'm a little bit more snobby and picky about it than a normal person would be because you know, this is, this is home. This is my home environment. And so I know what it's supposed to look like. So don't, don't pay me any money. All right, well, looks like we're reaching the end of the island. Let's go check out this oasis over here. But yeah, I just want, since I'm having trouble with mods, but I still want to cover mods, and Teutonia has updated, I figured, why not? Oh, I, I almost was able to drink. Yeah, I seem to have trouble drinking. But like I said, I'm going to report that to the mod, and they can look into it. This is why mods are still on the public test branch. Can you imagine if, you know, you couldn't eat or drink on the map? Anyways, let's see. It still looks nice, though. Mm -hmm. We're just exploring the last little bit of, uh, of the map. Our quest is really far away, so there's no point trying to do that one. I think we're about done, though. Is that a little cave? That is a little cave. Why are your stalactites sideways? That doesn't make any sense. They can't grow sideways. They only grow up and down. Oh no, I can't get in. It's only for small critters, I guess. That's not fair. I want to go explore. Dang. I mean, maybe there's another opening somewhere? I guess I can walk around this giant rock and see if there's an opening anywhere. About out of stamina, but we'll, we'll give it a shot. We can try. Why not? It looks like there's a little land bridge right there. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, that is a little land bridge. Well, that's good. All right, we're going to go see if there is a cave opening anywhere along this side. There could be, maybe. All right, there is no cave opening. I've walked all the way around this, investigating all the little holes and crevices, and there's no... I can't find another entrance. So I guess eventually we'll just have to play a small dino and go take a peek inside that cave. But not for now. I think for now we're about wrapped up. Yeah, there's nothing up there either. We're about out of hunger, out of thirst and water as well. Wait, thirst and water are the same thing. Out of hunger and thirst. There we go. Yeah, I don't think there's a cave entrance for me here. I may have passed it, but I, I swear I looked carefully. 
so I don't know. Maybe it's meant only for small guys and not big ones. Yeah, there's nothing down there either. Oh well. Anyways, uh, I hope you enjoyed this little adventure into the desert of the Teutonia mod map. Hopefully, eventually, I can explore other mods. But right now, like I said, I'm having a trouble getting other mods to work, so... I'm kind of down to just two options if I want to look at mods. But like I said, I'm sure the developers are working on it. It'll get fixed eventually. That's the public test branch for you. Anyways, thank you for watching.